I'm Susan Gaelic. I'm a nurse in pediatric neurology at Dartmouth-Hitchcock. I'm here today to demonstrate giving a dose of midazolam, which is an alternative seizure rescue medicine to diastat. It's widely accepted as a medication for prolonged seizures, frequent seizures, and it has been accepted in the community and in medical literature. First of all, I'd just like to explain what you will need to give this medicine. First off, I'd like to say what we would need to have this on hand for a child's seizure rescue medicine. Each child um, will, should have a seizure plan made up by the neurologist and the parents that is appropriate to their seizure type and weight. Uh, also, you may have a demonstration um, poster that shows how to give this medication. It's always helpful in the um, time of need. There would be a syringe, the vial of medicine, and the nasal atomizer. This nasal atomizer is called a mucosal atomization device. It is reusable, they're kind of hard to get. They come from medical supply houses. Um, our neurologists supply them for the parents, but there are some other sources. All this could go into a Ziploc bag and you could make up one kit of all these items for each place that the child goes, such as school, home, and um, daycare. So, First of all, um, when a child is having a seizure, parent or other staff member comes into the room and is wondering what's going on, the first thing they would do is go over to the child and check out what's going on and immediately turn the child onto their side. Not always easy, but if you reach for the child's knee, sometimes it's, easy, it's more um, available and um, you put something soft under their head so that they are not injured. And for one minute, I advise just watching what's going on. You can tip up their chin a little bit. You don't put anything in their mouth because that would be dangerous to the child and yourself. And observe the eyes, the mouth, any twitching, body stiffening or twitching. If the seizure is going on for more than one minute and it hasn't slowed down, you can put something behind the child if you're alone to help prop them onto their side. Hopefully they're able to stay in that position while you go to get your phone and the medication. So you found your kit, hopefully, and you open up your syringe you open up the medication, which has a click top on it. You don't need to use an alcohol wipe because it's not a sterile procedure. According to the child's seizure action plan, you would review exactly the amount of medication that the child was to be given. This one says two milliliters. So you pull back on the syringe to two milliliters of air and you tip up the vial, place the syringe into the vial and insert that air. Pull back now and the medication will easily come into the syringe all the way to two milliliters or whichever measurement you're supposed to use. Pull that out, make sure there's not a, no air in there just to be accurate with the amount of medicine. Then you remove the needle, which is not involved in the procedure anymore, and attach this atomizer. It has a tight screw top. Come back to the child, still having a seizure, and the safest way to give this medication is to steady your hand underneath the child's head, maybe somebody else can help you, and have them look towards you. This medicine has a very nice um, spray that is easy on the nose. You give half 
volume in each nostril. Place it gently against the nose, point toward the ear and upward, and give half in each nostril. Allow the child to just rest in that position for just a moment while you observe any kind of distress or breathing issues, which are unlikely, but sometimes they start to cough. And watch for the seizure to start to relax. Um, within three to five minutes, the seizure should be cleared. If it is not calming down, then you would call 911 as soon as possible or ask somebody to do that. Each seizure action plan has its own direction. Um, some children have to have their medication given immediately, and some children have to have the 911 called immediately. But you might review that ahead of time. You can also practice with this kit ahead of time. Thank you.